when the idea of a billboard tax to fund art was first proposed. I'm going to go forward to 2003 when the council under, uh, committed to reach, 2000, uh, reach $25 per capita by 2008. And then, uh, between 2005 and 2013, we had uh, four different public opinion polls which showed a steady 70% of the population support the idea of a billboard levy for art. Uh, this was a present, HODA presentation in 2006-2007 when uh, I, the billboard tax for art was approved by council to go forward uh, as a research stage. This is part of the report back from staff saying that during two rounds of public consultations, the revenue for the billboard tax was going to go to art. Uh, this was a large rally in city council in 2009, well attended by young people and artists from across the city. Uh, this was when the Amborski report came back in 2009, showing the billboard tax is going to art. This was a city press release saying the billboard tax is going to art. This was a presentation by Anna to council saying the billboard tax was going to art. Uh, this was what actually happened in council. The tax was passed. It was shunted to the budget committee with express directions from uh, the then budget chief saying no way it was going to be taken away from the art. Budget committee actually um, yeah, put a go for recommendation to reach $25 per capita by 2013. That commitment was reaffirmed in the next administration under Ford uh, to reach $25 per capita. And then during that year, actually uh, 2012, Christmas came early and the nine Santa Clauses at the Supreme Court rejected. The, uh, to hear the arguments against the billboard tax. At that point, we had a large party at City Hall. You can see Gary Crawford and staff up getting together. And there was rallies down Young Street, councillors jamming in, uh, in the rotunda, councillor Thompson having way too much fun. Um, and in January, the uh, council committed to a uh, four year plan to reach $25 per capita over four years. You can see the motion paper on there. Uh, it was well celebrated across the city. This is a party in uh, Regent Park, well attended by councillors, and it's widely celebrated in the press. Uh, and then just this year, we actually slightly tweaked it to make sure that economic growth and vibrant public spaces was a key priority, and that really gets to the core of why we do this might go to art and why we do the art center. Right on time. Excellent question, Councillor Mahevich and then Councillor Lake. Okay, thank you for your presentation. It's a well-documented series of decisions. <laughs> so um, that, that Council has made over the last few, couple of year and a half or so since the billboard tax got formalized and got, we started to receive the money given the Supreme, uh, given the court's decision. Yeah. So would you view it as a fundamental betrayal of trust for us to basically Face it in over a longer period of time after all this work has been done? I would call it backsliding. And I think that, that uh, you can, when you when there's been at least many commitments, and then to go back and say, well, we can't really do this, is a little bit, it seems a little bit uh, weird. Especially after it's so widely celebrated, after there's been so many quotes in the media, after there's been so many staff reports, after we've had so many promises that have been fulfilled. Um, it seems a little bit Thank you. Um, for late, so just to clarify, that's what you're asking us here to do today, yeah. to follow through on the commitment that you very clearly documented we made. Yeah, three um, times. Three times. <laughs> the, much, uh, the much celebration at, at several occasions. Yeah. And what, at, at what stage was it brought to your attention that we were going to take a different time here? And, it wasn't a private conversation where, oh, we're having trouble, we can't do this. It was through the standard method. Uh, just the city, uh, uh, the budget, when the budget was released. When the budget was released. Yeah. So there was no indica indication given prior to no. that this may be held no. back? No. Okay. Thank you. Okay, we're moving to the council <laughs> 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 Billboard tax revenue. Mm -hmm. um, did you 
know how much we generated last year and uh, what's being projected for this year? 22 million went to reserve for the time when it was sort of bouncing back to the in, in court system. And then it, it earns about $10.5 million a year. Uh, 22 million earned 20, 22. Oh. Ten and a half was put into reserve no, while we were waiting. Twenty-two went into a reserve. Yes. We released six and last and year, per year, and then ten and a half new revenue comes in every year. That's why it, it also made me really uncomfortable with what staff were saying, which is they were saying that we, we have to delay because otherwise we have to put more on the tax base. But it doesn't make any sense when we've got this massive reserve sitting there, along with another ten million coming in every year. It's just it's nonsensical. Okay. All right. Thank you. Next, Councillor into committee, Councillor uh, Crawford. Okay, like I said, one minute here. Uh, Six million last year. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a commitment of 17 and a half million yeah. in one over four years. Yeah. Okay, and, and so when you do the math, we have what? I think 11 and a half million dollars still left to allocate. Are you concerned over that next three years where that allocation is? Because we have to figure out in the next three years where that 11 and a half or how we Right, suggestion so far is we do more than $3 million that's already been staff recommendation for this year, but again, we still have to, that $11.5 million has to be spread out over three years. Where do you see this year's uh, number being? Is three now? What do you think it should be? It should be in the, the six range to follow, to be able to reach the targets that were, that were set. So then the last two years would be considerably back. Because yeah. again, you're trying, you're talking four million dollars, four and a half million dollars in the next year. Okay, thank you. I'm sure Pastor. Our cultural staff to make those sorts of cuts. 